Hey everybody, Radaman here for what is this now? Episode 20? My goodness. Um, we have survived quite a few winners and I'm intending to survive quite a few more. So let's get to it. Uh, last episode, we... Well, a lot of weird stuff happened, but uh, chiefly amongst them, we... Uh, we survived everything that the storyteller threw at us, and I plan on continuing that trend. So, as for comments, let me slow down the game. Um, Scrap here said I should make myself a lizard leather armchair, or lizard skin armchair, um, so that uh, I can be comfortable when trying to... Uh, Taylor in the cold. I like that. I can get behind that. I will plop one down promptly. Um, what else? Okay. A lot of people said I need more batteries. And by a lot, I mean Mats, Elmer, Matty, uh, Archangelos, Giovanni, Dylan, Matthias, Jay, uh, GE, MCM. Like, so many people said I need more batteries. It, it got almost comical. I didn't think it was funny, because cause you were all telling me I was doing something wrong. But, um, but yeah, so, so I'll do that. Actually, hold on, don't do that. Let's just get to it. Uh, this arbitrarily will become my battery bank. Why? I don't know. But y'all said I need more batteries, so let's go ahead and make some. That's gonna be have to be enough for now. I know I'm sure you want me to make more batteries, but I'm not going to. Um <clears throat> And of course, of course, I get a solar flare right as I craft up the battery. That's just, um, ridiculous. Just ridiculous. Uh, alright, so other things, um, I'll get to after this solar flare. Okay, so we have a good armchair. All the plants, of course, are going to die cold. Uh, Alright, so speaking of cold, let's set up... Oh, we kind of already have one. Let's fix this. This is going to be a warm area. Uh, I'm actually, I don't even want them in bedrooms. So when a pawn is cold, um, I can assign them to warm. And I don't know. I'm right now just OCD painting. But uh, this will keep them warmer. Uh, so let's manage areas. Keep warm. And then I can go ahead. Oops, I need to set a bunch of policies. Um, what is this? Restrict to... Oh, I need to even set some scheduling. Keep warm. All right, so now they're all going to keep warm. For right now, it's not cold enough to do any harm. They're just playing chess and hanging out, being idle and shit. Um, yep. So that's happening. Uh, I also wanted to separate out my trade zone. Mike Brown suggested to do as such. So I'll plan to do that once it's a little bit warmer. Alright, who is getting hypothermia first? It will be Kuro. So we'll just watch his health. In fact, uh, let's save our survival meals.
Okay, you're starting to shiver. Come on, Solar Flare. Uh, I don't want to... Oh, great. Home and Condor got the flu. Uh, alright. That's retarded. Thanks for the solar flare flu. Right, how cold are we? Are we going to have to set fires? This solar flare has lasted quite some time. Okay, you got me. You're, you're freezing me. <sighs> Alright, uh, temperature, campfire. Let's set it in here. Lift the restrictions. I'm going to restrict them to, uh, yeah. If I'm lifting it, I might as well set it to unrestricted. Okay, Sarah, get that going. Close these vents, and yeah, that's what I thought. Effin dill hole. All right. Um, bed rest. We will set home, and who is it? Kiro. Who's sick? No, Condor. Uh, to bed rest. Let's switch them around. I prefer home. As a pond in general. Alright. Copy settings. We've got some sick ponds, a whole farm that needs sowing. A lot of random crap in the base. And everyone's, oh, there we go. I was gonna say everyone's sleeping peacefully. So they're not exactly getting the best medicine care, but whatever. Not giving them the full-fledged meds. Alright, so this stockpile is going to be for caravanning. I don't know. I'll just call it caravan. That way I'm not spelling it incorrectly. Um, and here we're going to go with survival meals and where is furniture? Buildings, furniture. Um, the brain's having a bit of a hiccup. Bed roll. There it is. We have a lot of survival meals, thanks to the raid, mostly. Who's on minor break? Condor? Alright, I can get rid of your trapped inside. Just have you stand out there like a, a dill hole. I don't know what a dill hole is, but it's what he is now. You feel a little less stressed, buddy? I didn't think so. Uh, Alright, so we have that set up. Now we can pull steel out of here. That will save some more room. 
I'll put the steel here. Uh, let's collapse buildings, raw resources, and steel. blocks and chunks here this was uh, long overdue so stone chunks and stone blocks definitely gonna need some more meals Speaking of which, uh, Nicholas told me I should have a mini kitchen, and he is damn right. I should have a mini kitchen. Um, just brainstorming where I would put such a thing. Um, hmm. Trying to keep the symmetry of the base. I'll keep thinking it over. Shouldn't have fed that fire. Oh well. There we go. Wasted a little bit of wood there. Alright, so we're pulling a lot of stuff out of the uh, general stockpile that just does not need to be there. What is this? Is this ice texture coming through the carpet? Kind of looks like that. I'm not doing medicine even when you're sick. I don't think that's all that useful. Um, but what do I know? All right, so it's almost the end of winter. We're getting there. Checking weapons. Uh, you just have a bolty. Guess we'll give you an assault rifle. So we got the extra batteries. We have eight batteries and 13 turbines. I'm sure people are gonna say more batteries, more batteries, but Alas, I don't have an infinite amount of steel. I do have a lot of steel out there that I could get, but uh, I haven't grabbed yet, obviously. All right, let's check up on our patients. Immunity and illness are neck and neck, actually. Um, So Mr. Holm is going to get kicked up to slightly better um, medicine. And by slightly better, I mean he had no medicine before. All right, bulk goods trader. That sounds fun. Uh, cow. I'm quite tempted to purchase a cow. I haven't fully accepted it yet, but I'm tempted. All right, I'm going to sell the kibble because it's kibble. Um, a lot of smoke leaf joints. Goodbye. Thanks for making me money. Selling my beer off. I'm just going to go through all the things I need to sell first, and then I can look at stuff to buy. Uh, I might as well keep the practice for backup. Look at this amount of silver. Mm, mm, mm. I am rich for once. Everybody bow down at my richness. Um, I'm selling the simple steel helmet just because I plan on making better ones. Um, Alright, buying enough for dressers. Uh, let's see. 
other resources that I might want. I'm um, really... Do I buy a cow? I'm not going to buy a cow. I'm not going to do animal husbandry. It adds a whole new layer of complexity that I don't need to undertake, I don't think. Um, okay, so I'm going to buy some, some uranium for reloading. And I'm going to buy some glass steel. And that's about all I can afford. That's a lot of... Do they have blocks? These guys don't even have blocks. What kind of what kind of bulk goods trader doesn't have blocks? Are they trying to piss me off? Because it's working. Um, should I buy more than that? I'm gonna buy steel as well. I'll buy two fifty. No, two hundred. A little bit more than two hundred steel. That's everything. Uh, the thing is, oops, the thing is I can obviously move this around and sell some more stuff, so let's go ahead and do that. Well, Kiro brings... Oh, she's going... Hey, you know what? Fine, rearm it. There we go. Okay, uh, go juice. You can have... And I think what I'm going to do is I'm just going to, um... I'm just going to try to make some money here. Megasloth wool, okay. Keep that. Some thread. In case something nice and important is for sale, it'd be nice to have some silver. No, I did not say you could sleep. We are not done. We are not done. Um, might as well keep the extra cloth. Maybe I can make something of it eventually. And then if I'm to reinstall this around here, try to create a one stockpile. Uh, so that Everything is universally in the same place. That would be nice. That is for another day. So we have uh, 1,400 silver from all that. Or 1,409 or something. I don't know. Yep. Oh, even more. 16... 18 silver from all of that. Alright, mister. Yeah, immunity's climbing past uh, the sickness. Condor is just healing a lot faster. No, you bed rest. Getting a little bit of cabin fever, but you know what? It's fine. Oh, are you kidding me? You can't afford this. You know, I have to arrest him. Uh, I really can't afford him wandering around. That definitely, because he was imprisoned, is not going to help his mood, but at least he'll be alive. Alright, cargo pods, what did we get? Double strand, way out there. 
All right. Once I uh, finish sewing some of the um, home, can you stop doing everything? Just chill the f out. Let other people take care of everyone else. I thought I set him to. Oh, no, not good enough. Cabin fever wants to sleep with Sarah. Fine. No. That's not your bed. Just trying to do something that will be good for the mood. Cheer up your husband. Your husband. Alright, we can also pull wood out of this stockpile here, too. I'll just put it down here. Wood! Tend to Condor. Alright. Uh, home. Stop being a doctor. You are almost gonna die. He's already developed immunity. Alright, you know what? You just have to be there because you're too sick to not. Major break. Yeah, I know. But look, your immunity is barely outpacing. When's the next treatment? Four hours? Alright, so we tidied up this zone here. Uh, I think I need to take the shells out. Um, just because they're scary and dangerous, I need to make a mortar for them. Um, where are they? Manufactured... Mortar shells. All right, set owner Sarah. Your suicidal doctor, you're getting tended to. 100%. It's nice, right? Finally doing you right. So we have a lot of survival meals. I think um, next up will be transport pods. Um, I think that's my next pet project. Pod launchers be moved. I want to put them up here, but I'm worried that they'll they, they they'll need to be moved. All right, what's in here that shouldn't be? Uh, plasteel is in there, so let's move the plasteel as well. And gold and uranium. And then we also need uh, our textiles. Nice and clean. See? Everyone 
that has wanted this for so long. It is getting nice and clean. You. Oh, yeah, you're an eight cook. You're fine. All right. Make duster out of lizard skin. All right. So only things that are in here. Okay. Yeah, that looks good. Um, smelt weapon. I'm going to allow all weapons of excellent or lower, maybe good or lower, and we can keep that on. Get the smelt on. So he is extreme flu, which is a medical emergency. Uh, good SMG. Let's see. No triples, no doomsdays. No assault rifles. No charge rifles or charger lances. Productive base. The extra battery banks have paid off. Thank you, everyone. All right, so other uh, comments that I received. Um, Rob Rose said to smelt the weapons, so I obviously am doing that. Uh, Don Quixote shared a nice little caravanning trick. Uh, when I have one person out there caravanning, I can add more people to the caravan and uh, just gain magically more weight. So, I think I'm going to do that in a moment. Um, let's see that to its fullest. It's 18. Okay, it's perfect time. She has decent needs. Let's form a caravan with Sarah. Actually, someone said, do I need... Yeah, I need to choose a route. Uh, Alright. Miss Sarah. We are going to get this Devil Strand first. Home should be... Yep. He'll be fully recovered soon. All right, now let's get the PEM. And I'm going to add everyone else to the caravan. So, nope didn't work. Hmm. Am I doing it wrong? I don't know. Uh, let's go ahead and remove everyone else from the caravan. I understand how this is supposed to work, but clearly it did not for me. That's okay. I can just go back to the way I normally do it. Are you... Okay, immunity. He's going to need a little love. Because he's been pushed to the limit.
Alright, Holm has survived all that he went through. I'm actually going to change his research to mortars. We could use mortars for ships and sieges and the like. Would be pretty handy. Alright, now we have traditional heal root. Uh, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to set everyone's health. What is this? Assign everyone's health to heal root. Oh, alright. Uh, we got a blight. Clean up this blight before it spreads. Alright, it spread once. Not a big deal. And... Form Caravan. Let's see. So right from the start, I enlisted everyone. No, she still has her own mass carried. I don't think this is going to work. I might be doing it wrong. So if you know what I'm doing wrong, just let me know. I should have had her drop her sniper rifle and the like. Oh well. Because... I have to do this in one extra trip as a result. We're slowly slagging through our stockpile of weapons. This looks like it needs more space. Increase the radius. All right, feeling pretty good about progress. Um, so we did want the transpo pods. Um, so what I'm going to do is, huh? Scratching my head is what I'm going to do. Trying to think of a way where to put it. Uh, let's see if it blocks um, windmills. Because if it doesn't, that will be nice. Okay, it does not. Something I probably should have already known. So we're going to make some chem fuel from organics. I'm going to set the target level to the max. And we're currently researching um, mortars. This would have allowed me to rescue um, silver six enemies. Sleeping mech. Dolores, the paramedic. Ooh, a raid. Sapper raid. Uh, coming from the south. 
That is the best direction. So obviously I'm going to ditch my long range in favor of fast firing because they're all meleeers. Actually Sarah, I don't even have time for you to go whatever you were doing. Ideally, I'd like to not use any turrets, or my big turrets. Oh, can you? Alright, what's my range? There we go. Now we have them engaged. They might punch some holes, but... I don't know what that one's doing. Punching holes in a marble wall. They sure are getting shot. And passing out due to hypothermia. And now they're fleeing. And I saved that wall. What is my reputation with these guys? Tribe, negative 80. I'm not gonna bother taking any prisoners. in it for the money. Alright, there's one more to strip. Actually, two more to strip. to be about it. Yep. All right. Uh, Sarah. Yeah, let's fix that battery. Ooh. And the windmill. Mr. Holm, being out there is stressing you out, isn't it? It's kind of cute. You're going to clean up blood splatter so much, you're going to drive yourself insane. have a nice rest and we'll be back back at this soon all right pace settings is this for the corpses yeah perfect I want to drag some of their bodies away from the wall but I'll forbid the ones that aren't close enough to set fire to anything important. Alright, Sarah, what you're going to do here for me is... Start collecting this stuff. Let's try 
Tribal's made quite a mess. And me having a little remorse. Killed them all. Mr. Condor, you're going to be the next hauler, just because you're standing out there already, and you're already starting to haul their stuff. Oops, that was an equip club. All set. All right, let's get rid of their bodies. We've been having to look at them for a while now. Another raid attacking immediately. Okay. Um. Hmm. Get the bodies, there is going to be more bodies. Alright, for the moment, let's go ahead and keep warm for everyone. Lose some of that hypothermia that I might have built up. Oh, look at these idiots. They aren't even going to really attack me. Damn it. There's going to be so many bodies. reach any of these nope 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 All right, then turn back and go this way some raid you guys uh, had All right, mr. home if you're out here to clean blood I think I'm gonna have you Start collecting stuff. Probably can't, you know, can't reach you in time. So much wealth for free. All right, um, add the caravan. I know this isn't the most interesting thing to watch. I apologize. I'm trying to do it quick and efficient.
let's go ahead and cancel the forming. Alright, we're going to turn this baby off. Good job, Condor. And if you're back outside already. Sorry, ooh, Kuro, what the hell are you wearing? Dog leather? Nine. Now we'll let them sleep. Mr. Condor, if you're out there already, I might as well do some cleanup. Just so much shit out here it is ridiculous. No, take them. God damn it. There we go. How cold are we? We still got a little bit of work left in us. corpse cleanup. What I'm just doing here is I'm trying to keep them off the walls so when I go to burn them um, I don't set anything on fire that I don't want to. Where did that land? Ooh, that landed real close. Oh, Condor is not in the mood to be doing anything right now. Right, let's have a beer. A little instant recreation. Look at that zone. Holy moly. Speaking of zone, let's move the beacon. I'm not certain that that's still a thing, but if it is... Uh, Let's um, adjust smelt weapons. Let's not allow incendiary, not allow sniper rifle. Not allow, okay. Uh, all right. Time to burn some bodies. How many bodies? We have so many bodies, it's ridiculous. Like uh, Molotovs were more effective. Maybe I'm wrong. All right, and for my caravan with Sarah, I don't want to burn any of the goods and the merchandise. We want to keep it all, so let's load this stuff in. I feel like she misses a lot more often with the uh, incendiary. Sure, it has more range, but if we're constantly missing, it's not as efficient. 
Alright, how's our health? Just hit minor. Alright, that's enough to burn these bodies and get back home. Well, that's a lot of bodies. Cleared out. What did you just... You put on the heavy... Okay, that's fine. We're missing one. Ooh, a medium drone. That's not good. Alright, Sarah, you're headed back out there. It is what you're made for. Um, she is in the best mood. Is the fastest runner. So she's our Olympic torch creator. It's weird to see tribals wearing not tribal clothing, given that the temperature is so low that they were forced to wear like parkas and shoes. I'm used to them just headdresses only, tribal wear, looking actually like tribals, but they're not this time. Alright, they're nice and burned. And then I'll have to really address the whole mood thing. Got some moody pawns here. I think that was the last of it. Nice. Got some mortars. Uh... Alright, so security, mortar. What is your. Oh, psychic drone. Yeah, yeah. That, that will do it. What if I had you drink a beer? A little alcohol warmth to uh, off-put the psychic drone. Alright, so we still, of course, have all these corpses out here. And it's uh, 5th of April, so it's warm enough that we're going to start to be able to mine and uh, do longer hauls. Don't want him disturbing the sleep of the others. It's really weird that there's uh, this pattern of whatever it is in there. Oh, we're preferring pemmican. That's fine. Alright, Kiro, I don't want you constructing any of this. Stop. You aren't as good as our dearest leader. Who just made a bunch of good ones. Whatever. All the bedrooms are now slightly impressive. Alright, so now we have a steel mortar. Um, which will allow us to bomb out any ships... And again, it does not interfere with the wind turbine, so that's wunderbar. Let's get our cook on. She is just super happy.
I don't want to consume. Oh, we are already hauling to the stockpile. I was like, why isn't it letting me haul? We have most of the research for Starflight, which is pretty cool. Uh, Alright, Sarah, again, I know I'm tapping you to do the grunt work, the hard work, the heavy lifting in a uh, colony full of men, you outwork all of them. Too much left to do out that way. Alright, let's get a little high on Psychite T. Helps with the mood. This uh, Psychic Drone is not doing us any favors. Meteorite. Thanks. Alright, Psychic Drone is over. Good. That was really hurting, hurting the mood here. There's just so much nonsense in the way of tribal crap in our base now. It is kind of funny. So I never got that mini kitchen that I um, said I would. Um, hmm. I'm not sure where to put it. I'll still brainstorm that. Uh, some of the other comments. So Jay Davis said mortar. In the windmill area. Um, Rodrigo and Xenon told me to do the warm zone instead of just recruiting them and having them, you know, stand where I want them to. Um, and yeah, that's about the last of those comments there. I hope that uh, I have entertained you for this episode 20. It was uh, a bloody one, one that involved a lot of dead uh, tribals. And um, a pretty bad solar flare as well, now that I remember correctly. If you have any feedback for me, you've got to drop me a line. It's pretty easy to do. I'm pretty good at responding, I'd like to think. And uh, if you have a good enough uh, suggestion, maybe I'll even uh, credit you with it. Right? That's the idea. Um, Alright, guys. Well, that's been episode 20. If you... Um, liked it, maybe think about liking, subscribing, whatever, and I'll have to catch you all uh, next time. Adios, everyone.